What are some of the problems that you see? I don't really see many problems at all. Does everybody you know have decent jobs? No. Well, some people do and some people don't. The minimum wage today under which 5 million American workers labor is not really a minimum wage, it is a starvation wage. Since my first day in Congress, I have been fighting to raise the minimum wage. And the fact of the matter is that millions and millions of American workers cannot survive, cannot live in dignity. In America today, we have the most unfair distribution of wealth and income in the history of our country and of any major country on earth. Are we gonna raise the minimum wage to a living wage? What we are saying loudly and clearly is $7.25 an hour. The current federal minimum wage is a starvation wage. It's gotta be raised to a living wage. But we believe that in the United States of America, the wealthiest country in the history of the world, that if you work 40 hours a week or 50 hours a week, you should not be living in poverty. We're gonna have a minimum wage, which is a living wage, 15 bucks an hour. And one of the great crises that we're facing is that so many of our people in the richest country in the history of the world are literally struggling to put food on the table. I don't think $15 an hour is a radical idea. The vast majority of the American people are supportive. Here's right. the point. The point is that half of our people today, 50% of workers in America are living paycheck to paycheck. They work 40 hours a week. They don't have a nickel to put into the bank for the future. So we have got to address that issue of low wages and millions of people struggling after working 40 hours a week and raising the minimum wage will be a significant step forward.